Hey folks, today we visit an abandoned naval shipyard and base that at one time was the largest on the west coast. Looking at the eerie remains, it's hard to imagine Mare Island Naval Shipyard producing over 500 submarines and naval ships, as well as servicing over thousands of submarines and naval ships, before its decommissioning and closure in 1996. Mare Island is on the north end of San Francisco Bay, just across the Napa River from the city of Vallejo. Mare Island Shipyard and Base operated for 142 years. During World War II, it employed 46,000 civilian and naval workers, including 8,000 women. In 1970, they stopped manufacturing nuclear submarines at this facility, but they continued to service and repair submarines and naval ships until the closure in 1996 when employment at this base was 9,000 people. During World War II, the facility included a hospital, ammunition depot, paint and rubber testing labs, schools for firefighting, opticians, and anti-submarine war tactics. During World War II, this facility built 17 submarines, four sub-tenders, 31 destroyer escorts, and 300 landing craft, as well as servicing thousands. When the Mare Island Naval Shipyard and Base closed in 1996, it encompassed some 5,200 acres. shelters built during World War II. One of Mare Island's key functions was to build explosive ordnance. Shipbuilding is what Mare Island is known for. In 1859, the first ship was built at Mare Island. In 1911, they built a 130 foot by 32 foot platform on top of the USS Pennsylvania. A pilot successfully landed on that ship while it was stationary in the San Francisco Bay, leading the way for aircraft carriers. Mare Island founded its submarine program in the 1920s and leading up to and during World War II it specialized in submarines. During the Vietnam War, the Navy did swift and riverboat training in the surrounding sloughs of the Napa River and the adjacent delta. About 10 years after Mare Island closed, the city of Vallejo filed for bankruptcy. It's been slow to redevelop the area, but thankfully, one of the first redevelopments was the Mare Island Brewing Company. Check your stores and we'll see you later.